holy shnikes could it be? We found something at the Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree movies, what do we wait for? Let's go. Dollar Tree. Somebody told me they may have gotten some new movies in. Probably just be a box or so, but hey, that's better than nothing. So, hey, look at here, right on top. The Twilight Zone fan favorites. Oh man, it's like a whole stack. The seventh day. Holy shnikes, I wasn't prepared. And whatever that is, it was like somebody just throwing wipes everything over here. What is this? Sass Red Notice. Oh man. Pacific Rim we've seen before. IP Man 2. Hey, that's some Blu-rays. Deck the Heart we've seen. I think Hustle we've seen. What Men Want. Hey, I don't think I've got that. Hmm. The Death Star. That looks like a documentary. Violet we've seen. So a lot of this is old stock. Absolution, yeah, we've seen that. Best of Chris Rock. That's a snapper. I don't know what version of that I have, but I have that already. The Dawn. Switch. Well, that was pretty cool. Hmm. Belong to Us. 68 Kill. Parallel. Wow, it's some new titles. Hard Kill. We've seen that on Blu-ray. So that's not new. The Ugly Truth. Nuclear we've seen on Blu-ray. That's an Echo Bridge title. So Shark Knight we've seen. So it's like a mix. Maybe they got like one new box and they spread some of the stuff over the the uh, stack here. Faith. I don't know if I've seen that or not. Annihilation. I've got that on 4K. That was a season up under there. I skipped over of from Dustin on. There's Hard Kill. We got that with a slip cover. Look at that. The Loud House. Hmm. Some old stuff down there, like really old. So you gotta dig, but sometimes you do find new stuff. Uh, let's see what else we got. So this is all the stuff we looked through. I don't need those wipes there. Capone, I think I got that already. Son of the South. Christmas Hero. Brothers by Blood. I don't remember seeing that. Is that the dude that was in Suicide Squad? A score to settle. A Nick Cage with a slipcover. Uh, I've, I've already got that, so I'm not going to pick that up. Pistolera. D-Train. I got that on Blu-ray recently. The Haunting. That's a Fangoria Fright Fest title. Phobias. A couple horror titles here. That's pretty cool. I think Blood on our name we've seen in that... 45 years. I don't know what that is. Hmm, that looks kind of cool. Enhanced. I like that. And here's a Blu-ray down here. I am woman. So that might be interesting. Damn, it's a lot of new ones here. Being human, we've seen. Hey, there's some turtles. Cody, my buddy. If you like watching this video, if you like turtles, right? Have you seen that one? Put some comments down below. All this stinking ass MGM stuff didn't get cleared out during the buy two, getting one free. There's Jack Reacher. I've got that. Triple X. Yeah, I've seen most of this stuff. Hey, Boyhood, we just got that. Um, oh, do I have that? I don't know. Either way, Richard Simmons. Sheep and Wolves. Pig Deal. <laughs> A lot of these Echo Bridge titles. So maybe this store didn't clean out a lot of their stock. There's that switch without a slip cover. Out of the furnace, I've got that on Blu-ray. Some Echo Bridge stuff still. There's another sass. Hey, look, here's another Turtles. Anybody seen that? Is that any good? Mile 22 is a pretty good movie. I've seen that. 
Holy shnikes, it's another stack over here. Quiet place. Jack Hunter. Those are pretty decent D movies. The Haunted Body Brokers. World's Greatest Dad with a, um, Robin Williams. I don't think I got that. Henchman, I picked that up through my online buddy in the past. Ben Hur. There's another Jack Reacher. Like a boss. Any of those DVDs that have digital codes, I'm pretty sure the digitals redeem in HD, so they filth. That looks pretty cool. So you could get those and then um, redeem them and then do whatever you want to with the with the DVDs. Act of Valor, I think we had that on DVD. I might have to get that on Blu-ray. So some family stuff down in here. History of the Colts. That's an NFL one. My dad might like that. So I'm digging Payback. Oh man, that's so a lot of new titles in this store. So it was definitely worth coming in here. So check your Dollar Trees. Transporter Refueled. I already own that. Man, not that movie is uh, not that good without Jason Statham in it. So I think that's going to be about it. So let's see what I pick up and come on home with me and I'll show you the haul. So what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the Jeffman 316 Pop Culture Reporter Channel. I'm your host as always, Jeffman 316. And yeah, we found some stuff at the local Dollar Tree. Can you believe it? They had some new movies out. It looked like it was probably one or two new boxes. So I know a lot of people are finding big lot stuff there, but I didn't find that. But we'll dig into it. I'm going to show you what I picked up. I picked up quite a bit. I think I was just a little overly excited because I found movies at Dollar Tree. The Seventh Day is the first movie. It's got Guy Pierce in it. It's got a slip cover, but I'm not going to be able to take it off. And, you know, it's always got these uh, stickers over top of where the slips go. The next movie is called, I guess it's called Switch. Um, it's got some kind of writing at the bottom there. I don't know exactly what that says, but Switch. And this looks, that cover artwork looks really cool. So, so the next movie is SAS Red Notice. It's got, um... Ruby Rose in it and Andy Serkis. I'm not a huge Ruby Rose fan, but I figured for a buck I'd get it. Two of those are vertical releases. We found a lot, seen a lot of vertical releases. There's going to be two more or three more right here, I think at least. Um, enhanced. I don't know anybody that's in this. Annabelle Bell, but the cover artwork is cool. Probably like one of those ones with the cover artwork better than the artwork on most everything, like from um, you know Wild Eye releasing. Matt Levitt and Payback. So I don't know anything. That's another vertical release. Hey man, the next two are verticals too. Parallel, you can't go back from the executive producer of Joker. So I don't know anybody in this one either, man. It, the cast on these movies are not wowing me. But either way, the next one is The Unfamiliar. So that looks like a horror movie. So that'd be cool to check out. If any, I want some comments down below if you've seen any of these movies. Because these are a bunch I've never heard of. Fangoria Fright Fest The Haunting. So this is from uh, Phase 4 Films. Um, the next one is a comedy and I've heard of it. And I've actually seen part of it and didn't 100% like it. But I figured I'd give it a chance for a buck. Like a boss, Selma Hayek. I really do like Rose Bob Byrne. It's got Tiffany Haddish in it. So, is Tiffany Haddish's um, Five Minutes of Fame over? Um, World's Greatest Dad with Robin Williams is next. I think I've seen this movie and I thought I wanted it. It's a mag no, a Magnolia. I almost said mag Magnolia Pictures release. So, uh, you know, Robin Williams, we've lost him too early, sadly. Rest in peace. The Death Star, Unlock the Secrets of How the First Stars Were Born. I love documentaries, and this is a BBC one, so I thought that would be cool. Um, speaking of documentaries, this is The Cults, The Complete History. This is from Warner Brothers. This is a two-disc set, which it looks like it's got the historical Johnny Unitas stuff, Cults, and then it's got the Peyton Manning stuff after that. Um, got some uh, kid stuff next, um, and I'm, I'm a kid at heart, so I love it. The Loud House, Absolute Madness Season 2, Volume 2. I figure for an animated series, it wouldn't matter. Um, that's a two-disc set. 
Um, it wouldn't matter if I didn't have it or, you know, understand what was going on. Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Mutant Mania from Nickelodeon. Hey, Cody, I, if you watch this, I know you watch a lot of, um, um, of uh, turtles. Let me know about these next two because I got another one. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Enter Shredder. I remember getting a couple of these that were in Spanish cases. So I don't know if I've got those or not. But the next uh, four are going to be Blu-rays. Um, the Helen Reddy story, I Am Woman, Hear Me Roar. So that's in a slip cover, so that's kind of cool. Um, Act of Valor, I own this on a Dollar Tree DVD. I think I actually bought it and gave it to my father for Christmas. I didn't have it on DVD now because I gifted it, but I figured I'd go ahead and get the Blu-ray. He's all into, you know, war, action movies, that type of stuff. Uh, the next one is a Blu-ray DVD digital, and this is a Paramount release of What Men Want with Tracy Morgan. And um, I forget how you pronounce her name. Tara G. Tara G. P. Henson. I, I apologize for murdering people's names. And then the last movie I got is from Jane. It's got James McAvoy, Jamie Bell. It's Filth. I don't know anything about that movie. Let me know. But I bought it because of this shit right there. Look at that dude. Look at that pig man. But, so, hold your horses. I forgot a title. One fell out of the bag. Five DVD collector set. Twilight Zone fan favorites. It's got such stuff as The Nightmare at 20,000 Feet. The Odyssey of Flight 33. A Game of Pool. It's a lot of the classic episodes there. There's night. There's The Nightmare in episode with William Shatner. Yeah, this is a five disc set. I had to let you know, look out for that at the Dollar Tree. I couldn't believe I found it. So now I'll go ahead and let the video end. Let's go. I thought my first trip back into the Dollar Tree needed to be epic. And there you go. So I thought that was pretty good. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Do all the normal YouTube stuff. Um, I'll do everything for you guys, including balancing this fucking stuff, which is a bad idea. But either way, I don't have anywhere to set it right now. So I'm going to close out the video. Um, hit the notification bell. You'll know when I post new videos. Support me on social media, JeffMan316 on Twitter and on Instagram. I'll probably post this big stack after the video post. But either way, until next time, boys and girls, this has been JeffMan316. And as always, I'm your pop culture reporter. And I'm signing out saying you guys be safe out there.